Everything you need to know about solar inverters. Solar inverters make powering your home with solar energy possible. Houses are wired to operate on alternating current, AC, power. Every photovoltaic solar energy system for use with household electricity requires a way to transform the direct current, DC, energy created by the solar panels to AC power. What is a solar inverter? Solar inverter's main function is to accept DC power input and turn it into AC power. They also act as the primary connection between the panels and the electrical distribution panel in the house. Modern inverters contain switches that can connect or isolate your solar energy system from the power grid and provide detailed information to your system's monitoring equipment. A solar inverter isn't a charge controller. A charge controller manages electrical input and distributes it to batteries or the electrical system. They're integral to solar energy storage systems in addition to inverters. There are two types of solar inverters. String inverter. A string inverter, or central inverter, is a large device that accepts DC input from multiple solar panels and transforms all of the energy to AC. You could say that it works to transform energy in bulk amounts. In a solar energy system with a string inverter, all or several solar panels are wired into one centrally located inverter. The inverter then feeds the electrical panel or the grid. In short, a string inverter changes the power from DC to AC after the power is collected from the solar array. Pros String inverters are the least expensive inverter option. They are simple to install and wire and have fewer components that can break. Maintenance is easy, and troubleshooting or repair work is simplified by all elements being in one location. Cons String inverters can't discern which panel is sending power. Because all of the panels send energy to the inverter in bulk, if one panel stops or slows production, the entire system becomes limited to the maximum power generation of the weakest panel. In other words, the whole system is less productive if one panel experiences less sunshine than the others due to shade, snow cover or other elements. Also, String inverters handle a lot of power simultaneously, which generates heat. The heat must be dissipated by placing the unit in the shade, cooling it with fans or both to keep it running efficiently. Microinverter You'll need more than one microinverter. Microinverters are located at each solar panel and convert that panel's energy immediately before sending it to the house electrical to meet up with all of the other inverters' power. A solar energy system that uses microinverters treats each solar panel as its own. AC power source and feeds the energy to the home or electrical grid. Pros Microinverters immediately change the DC power to AC at the solar panel. If one panel or inverter slows production or fails, the other panels and microinverters aren't affected, and each one can continue to provide maximum power to the system. Microinverters are small devices that don't generate much heat and don't require mechanical cooling to maintain optimal energy efficiency. For that reason, they also last longer than string inverters. Cons Microinverter technology is more expensive than string inverter technology, and each panel requires its own inverter, so you must purchase more units. That means that the system as a whole is more costly than its counterpart. In addition, there are more active components in a microinverter system, and those parts are located on the roof. Meaning maintenance is more involved, and troubleshooting or repairs are more expensive. String inverter with optimizers Technically not a different type of inverter, a string power inverter with optimizers is a combination of components. In such a system, a solar panel has an optimizer that gathers as much DC power as the panel can generate and sends it to the central inverter. The other optimizers do the same. The inverter collects the DC energy from each optimizer and inverts it into AC as a whole before sending it to the house or grid. Pros Power optimizers act similarly to microinverters in that each panel is independent of the next. That means that shade or sun blocking on one panel doesn't affect the efficiency of others or the system in general. Additionally, Power optimizers can monitor each panel's output for easy troubleshooting. The associated string converter has fewer active components than a microinverter system and is easy to maintain and repair. Cons 
String inverters with optimizers are more expensive than a simple string inverter system. Also, the optimizers are located on the roof at each solar panel, so repairing parts of the system can be more costly. That's all for today, I hope you enjoyed today's video and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to watch more future videos.